Brady, how's the uh, how's the body? How you feeling? Uh, feeling good. You know, uh, everything uh, is progressing well. You know, feeling strong and I'll, uh, should be ready to go by uh, spring training. Are you completely healed or? Yeah, you know, I'm done with the rehab portion. You know, now it's just uh, a matter of getting back in shape and uh, you know, get my legs back underneath me and uh, just place that hit and grow my skin out it feels. So spring training, you're uh, you're 100 percent. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be good to go. Early impressions on Manny Acta. Uh, everything's been good. You know, I've uh, you know, had some short conversations with them that, uh, that went very, very well. And, uh, you know, I've heard nothing but good things about him. I'm excited to, uh, to work with him and the rest of the staff. Grady, how, how hurt were you last year? I mean, you seemed to gut it out no matter. We didn't really know how bad it was, but was it was it significant last year? Uh, well, I mean, it was bad enough to the point where I had to have surgery at the end of the year. I mean, uh, there was a couple injuries that you know, were nagging throughout the year, but, uh, you know, he tried to go out there and play. And, uh, you know, got through it and see what you could do. And, you know, we got to the point at the end of the year where we were, you know, we were out of it and, uh, you know, might as well shut it down and give myself more time to recover. You know, it's awesome. Great. Was there any thought about shutting it down earlier than you did? Uh, you know, we talked about it. You know, obviously, uh, you know, I went on the DL and tried to, uh, you know, get healed up as much as I could. And, uh, you know, you want to give yourself a shot. Even if it's a long shot, the team might uh, pull something out. You know, you want to give yourself that chance and give the team that chance. Do you regret not? Not shutting it down earlier? No, not at all. You know, I think I made the right decision. You know, I, uh, it was my call, and I wanted to stay in there as long as I could. You know, even if uh, you know, we were out of it, I still wanted to give myself you know, the whole se- much of the season. Brady, how tough is it? This is like the first year in a while you've been here where you guys aren't considered a, a real contender for the division. Uh, you know, that's not an issue for us. You know, sometimes when your uh, teams are looking you know, other, other ways and you know, forgetting about you, you can do the most damage. You know, uh, there's been years where we've... Uh, you know, we've been, you know, the favorite and fallen short in years, and we've been, uh, you know, kind of the underdog and, and, and rised up. So we're just going to go out there and take care of our business and, and go from there. What was it like walking into uh, the locker room this year, looking around and seeing a whole uh, bunch of new faces? Uh, it's different. You know, it'll be a different uh, different mindset this year. Obviously, we've got some young guys and a whole new staff. So, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to working with everybody and just getting the season started. Cordy, how have you handled uh, the internet thing? How, what have, what's been the ramifications of it, and what, what's your feelings on it? Uh, you know, as far as, as right now, I, I'm doing everything I can to put it behind. You know, those things uh, we all know what happened. Uh, you know, I uh, you know never intended for any of this to be public. You know, this is a private matter, and uh, you know I apologize that I have to be here talking about it. You know, right now, but uh, like I said I'm doing what I can to put it behind me. Was there ever, did you ever find out who, who stole the... You know, one, everything happened. The proper authorities were, uh, were involved, and, you know, everything was uh, handled appropriately. I'm sorry that I have to involve, you know, the Cleveland organization, my teammates, and, you know, the fans and all this, but, uh, again, it was a private matter. And, uh, I said, it's just one of those things. So with your girlfriend? Yeah, we're still together. Is it a cautionary tale? I mean, if you had to tell... Teammates or anything else? Would you say anything could happen? Uh, you know, it's scary that something like this can't happen. You know, uh, but like I said, we weren't. It's not like we were out there trying to, uh, you know, advertise ourselves or anything like that. You know, this was something that was uh, you know, shared between the two of us, and someone managed to uh, you know, get a hold of it and, and do what they did. Okay, Grant, you, you only you've only known Eric Wedge. Is there a little anxiousness for the new guy coming in and changing things? Probably. Uh, definitely. 100%. I mean, we're not. I can't say I know what to expect. You know, obviously it's a whole new staff, but I'm definitely excited about it. You know, I uh, I know a few of the guys and have had uh, a few conversations with the others. So, uh, you know, I think uh, we're all excited just to get out there and get playing. When you, talk, when, you t- have, when you've talked to Manny, has he mentioned? Uh, are you the leadoff hitter? Have you have you even talked about that? Yeah, we haven't really gotten in those discussions yet. You know, I. Uh, I know people have asked, but I said we haven't really gotten into that, uh, that area. I think, uh, you know, for me, I've always said that's not a big deal. I'll get wherever, you know, whatever's best for the team, and I'll, uh, you know, I'll play wherever I have to play. Do you have or haven't done baseball stuff yet? Oh, I have. Yeah, I've been, uh, I've been hitting and throwing since uh, December. So, uh, you know, it's been, uh, like I said, the progression's been really good. You know, no setbacks, everything's, uh, you know, on schedule. I'm not sure to are you on any limitations of what you can and can't do? Yeah, uh, not any limitations. I'd say it's more just uh, you know controlling the ball at this point. You know, it's just uh, you know, I can't go out there and take 200 swings if I want to every day. You know, it's, it's a slow progression. You want to build up to uh, the point where you're ready to go and you don't want to push yourself too hard and you know, set yourself back. Will you have any kind of restrictions or slow play once you hit spring training? Uh, you know, we'll see. That all kind of depends on how I feel when we get there. Grady, when you were out and you were watching the team at the end of last year, 
What came into your mind? What did you see? What did you like, dislike? Uh, watching your team play is hard. Uh, it's, it's not a good feeling. I hate being hurt and having to watch the guys out there every day. But uh, I liked what I saw. I thought uh, like I said, these young guys stepped up really well and played with uh, confidence and, and really showed their own and what, what is a realistic expectation for fans? Well, I mean, as players, you know, you expect to win. I mean, I don't, obviously, uh, you know, people are going to say otherwise, and you, know, you can't worry about that. But, you know, we expect to, to go out there and win and compete. We're going to you know, do our best to do that.